Well, hello there. How's it going, everybody? Muzzafuzza here bringing you some Call of Duty Black Ops 2, one in the chamber on Carrier today. Carrier being one of my favorite maps on this game. And I thought I would give you guys a little bit of an update today, uh, just letting you know what I think of these party games, specifically one in the chamber. Because I played a lot of one in the chamber ever since uh, Black Ops 1, and then I played a lot of it in Modern Warfare 3, along with All or Nothing and the different uh, party type games you could play in MW3. And those kind of, uh, you know, saved me from the boring multiplayer that just eventually gets kind of redundant and you don't want to keep playing it because it's so repetitive. But uh, Black Ops 2 feels like there's a lot of variety and there's variety with everything. There's variety with guns, perks, classes. Uh, I run into all different types of players all the time. Snipers, knifers, trick shotters, tryhards, SMGs, assault rifles, LMGs, shotguns. Like I run into every type of player you can possibly imagine and uh, that's a pretty good sign. Now granted you're only gonna get like those exciting fun YouTube gameplays if you're up against noobs, if you're up against people who really are kind of not knowing what they're doing and that's how you get these beast scores like 50 kills and one death or 100 plus kills or whatever it is. You gotta find some newbies to stomp. You gotta do the whole pub stomping thing. And uh, I haven't really been tryharding too much. I've been trying to get my diamond camo snipers. That's my first major objective with Black Ops 2 and I, I should be done with that uh, after a few more hardcore sessions of just trying to grind it out. But I've been playing a little bit of One in the Chamber and I'm not so happy with it on this game. I liked One in the Chamber on Black Ops, I liked One in the Chamber on Modern Warfare 3. On this one though, it, you use the cap, this cap 40 pistol, which is like the automatic pistol that you can dual wield. And the iron sight, I just don't like it. It doesn't feel right. Uh, I'm missing shots a lot and I guess that could be counted as a good thing because it's a really hard iron sight to use and you miss a lot of shots and that might make it more skill based but I would just personally prefer uh, if they made one in the chamber with a, a re regular pistol with a regular iron sight because this one is just I don't know I don't like it that much but let me know what you guys think of one in the chamber down in the comments below that was just a little quickie final score 10 kills 3 deaths and uh, I'll be posting a lot more Black Ops 2 videos shortly so stay tuned thank you guys for watching peace out